Welcome. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to set up a desktop shortcut to open up a TV stream from an HD home run on an Ubuntu system. So I have a series of videos on Ubuntu and uh, FFmpeg. In this video, I'm not going to use FFmpeg. I'll get into that in a minute. What I have here on the desktop is I have this icon. It says TV 5.1, which is channel 5.1 in my area. And I'll double click on this and it will open up a terminal and then it will open up a full screen TV stream on an HD home run. So I'll hit Q here to quit that. What I can do is I can go to my web browser and I can type in the IP address of my HD home run. And if we click on channel line up here, move this screen over, uh, we can see all the channels. So I've set the stream up for 5.1. So I'll open a terminal. And if we look at this 5 uh, TV 5.1 here, let's go to my desktop. And you'll see this uh, TV51 desktop. So I'll type cat TV51 desktop. You'll see I have this um, special file here that is like a shortcut file. And we have, we're executing a command here for MPV. So I have a video similar to this for Windows and I use FF Play, but I had trouble with FF Play on Ubuntu getting audio to work and MPV just works. So to install uh, MPV, you wanna type in sudo space apt space install space mpv and that will install mpv on your system now to make a second one of these i'll just copy what i have i'll say copy tv 51 desktop and i'll say tv 81 desktop and then i'll type nano and then tv 81 desktop and i'll go in here and i'll change this to 81 so to get this uh url here if you go under HD Home Run, you can right click on these and say copy link location. And then you can go in here and paste it in. Okay. But if you have one set up, you might as well just change the numbers because they're all going to be the same. You can read the numbers off here and then enter them in here. And then we have dash FS, which is full screen and dash dash interlace, which is interlace, obviously. This will open up the stream full screen. So I can type Control O to save and Control X to exit. So if we go here now and we double click on this, it's not gonna work. So I'll say cancel. I wanna go in here and say CHMOD plus X and then TV81 desktop. Okay, I had to mess with this a little bit. I'm not sure. I type minus X here. You want to type plus X. You're adding executable to it. It wasn't working and there's a reason. I type plus X and then when we double click on this, it'll say um, it's not trusted. You want to trust it. So I'll say trust and launch and now it will open up this uh, TV channel. 15 minutes here. Can save you 15%. And you should only have to do that once. You'll notice the icon change. So I'll double click here and it works. By 11 degrees because you know so something else you can do here is if you go into your HD Home Run interface and go to Transcode Configuration, you have this de default transcode profile and you can change this here or you can change it for each stream. So um, let's do Internet uh, 360. So I can go back into this file. I can type Nano TV 81 Desktop and I will go to the end here where it says 8.1 and I'll type question mark transcode equals internet 360. And I'll take a full screen off of this. Let's assume we don't want full screen either. So I'll type control O to save it, control X to exit. And now if we double click on this, it will bring up a 360p video here. So this is transcoded, so it's a smaller stream. And then it's not gonna look quite as good either, but um, you know, this might be good in certain applications. Like if you wanna have this playing in the corner of your computer. So you can copy these and you can make one for every station or you can make them just for like two or three stations that you like to check in on. Like if there's a weather station, you could, um, you know, set that up so you could double click on it and watch the weather, things like that. Although nowadays you just go on the web and find out the weather probably. But so if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments and I'll put, uh, I'll put this text here down below in the description or in the comments so you can, you know, see it um, or, or copy it if you want. But if you have any questions, please leave them below. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.